Yo, what's going on YouTube? Chuck D back again. Back again. Hopefully you're having a good weekend. Hopefully you're having a good week. Whenever you're seeing this video, hopefully your week or weekend is going well. So before we get this video started, um, if you like the videos, be sure you hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe. If you don't like the videos, uh, just continue doing what you've been doing, hitting the thumbs down. So <laughs> some of you guys already know, those who know me personally know that I recently made a change. Um, I did end up leaving FedEx Ground. I know you're gonna say, Trucker D, you left again, you left again. Yes, I left again. And this time, this is my last time switching carriers. I know it's not really good to job hop, but um, I'm doing what's best for me, you know? I got all my endorsements, I got experience, so I can pretty much go anywhere I want. So that's what I did. I had uh, mainly left because I need benefits. Bottom line, I need benefits and I need a more consistent schedule. So um, prior to FedEx Ground, I had applied for a lot of LTL companies. And if you don't know what um, LTL is, um, I made a video on what that is. So you gotta scroll back down. I think I put out a video on that maybe three months ago maybe even two I don't remember so check that out um, so I applied for a company a while back and they finally reached out to me uh, not that long ago and they gave me an offer I couldn't resist um, it's Monday through Friday it's a nighttime position uh, full benefits after eight weeks of employment couldn't pass it up so I did take the job and um, I know some of you guys are gonna wonder, where did you go? What LTL company are you at? And um, here's what I'm gonna do. I want y'all to comment below where you think I am. And the first person that can guess it, I'm gonna cash app you $20. So guess the company and put your cash app name. If you're right, I'll slide you $20. Now, if your name is Devin Roosevelt and Kiana, y'all don't count because I've already told y'all where I'm at. So y'all don't count. But yeah, comment below and I'll send you $20 if you're right. So one of y'all asked me, actually a few of y'all asked me, when is the best time to um, get into the industry? I would say winter time because if you're not used to driving in snow, you're not going to know how to drive 80,000 pounds down a 8% grade with snow. You're not going to know how to do that. So I would recommend um, start now. Start, you know, in the winter time. That way, your trainer can train you how to uh, put chains on. He can train you on how to uh, drive down the mountain. He can show you how not to be one of them guys in them pilots up on I-80. Um, I will warn you guys, though. Winter, it's a beast. It's a beast out there. That uh, I-80 up in Wyoming is no joke. Those mountains in Colorado, they're no joke. Utah is no joke, you know. Make sure you're taking your time when you're going down those mountains because it's it's a beast. I didn't seen it because I didn't did it. You know, I didn't did OTR, so I didn't seen those pileups firsthand. You know, I didn't been on weather shutdown. You know, I remember I was stuck in Wyoming last winter. I was stuck up there for like two, three days, snowed in. So um, if you're OTR. Going in the Northeast, it's inevitable. Going in the Midwest, it's inevitable. Going out West, you know? So you're not gonna dodge that snow. You're not, unless you're doing local in like the South, or if you're on a dedicate, you cannot avoid that Northeast, you know? It's brutal out there, but just take your time with it, you know? Just take your time, drive what's safe for you, you know? I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, and y'all know, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I'm gonna be honest. Them dispatchers, they gonna want you to keep rolling if you don't feel safe do not do not continue driving you know because your life is worth more than that low you know you don't want to be one of them guys on the news that's in them pilots you don't want to be one of them drivers that's jackknife in the ditch you don't want to be one of those because if you take i-80 you're gonna see a lot of that then like nebraska wyoming montana you're gonna see a lot of that so don't be one of them drivers do what's safe for you if they continue to try to make you drive i would tell them straight up put safety on the phone you know tell them what the weather's looking like tell them you don't feel safe you know you're in control of that truck you know don't jeopardize your cdl for that load 
So yeah, that's my best advice, start in the winter time. Um, I know a lot of y'all still ask me, what's the best company to go to? I cannot tell you, you know, it all just depends on what you're looking for, you know? There's no such thing as a perfect company. There's no such thing. Because as I said before, every company is gonna have its flaws, so. Um, that's all up to you. And I don't know why I still get people asking me, um, am I at Stevens? I've said this many times. I do not work for Stevens anymore. I left Stevens a long time ago. You know, I've said this many times. I put out a video on why I left them. So check that out if you haven't already. But yeah, y'all, I don't really have much to talk about. Um, I'm probably going to do the reveal of where I'm at probably, I'm thinking sometime in November, or maybe December. Um, this position, I do start at nighttime, um, typically around six, seven o'clock. So um, I'm going to put out some footage, but first I need to make sure that um, we're allowed to like film and do like YouTube. So I'm going to talk with my terminal manager when I go in uh, tomorrow night. And just to make sure that um, I'm allowed to do that. So um, I know I haven't answered all y'all's emails. I'm actually get to those um, as soon as I finish this video here. So just going to put out a video for y'all. Um, I do have another video that I've already pre-recorded. I'm going to upload that probably uh, sometime next week. But yeah, I'm about to... Uh, take my baby trick-or-treating so as i always tell y'all thank you to all my day one subscribers thank you to all my new subscribers i appreciate all you guys if you like the video hit the thumbs up if you don't you know what to do hit the thumbs down and as i always tell y'all y'all take it easy stay safe